So, you just shot your music video. You just shot in various locations and various takes. You just synced everything up. And now we're ready to chop it up. Let's get it in. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Why are you doing that? Oh, chill out. Chill out. Why are you doing that for? <laughs> Having to go back and forth and cut back and forth to just cut from scene to scene for music video, or even in general for synced up audio stuff, so is not the move for real. Why not just see it all at once and cut as you go along? Enter multicam mode. Let's check it out. So the way it works, after you've synced up everything and you're ready to start cutting it up, highlight everything, you go to where it says nest, nest it, then you go to where it says multicam, enable. Then you hit this little multicam button right here. And if it's not already on your toolbar, you can click this little plus button, drag it in there, bow, bow, bow. Once you do that, you'll see that the clips that you just nested together, they appear on the side right here. And they can be clicked on. And you notice that when you click on it, it actually cuts to that angle. Pro tip. You have to click on it at all, actually. You can just press 1 through 9 on your keyboard, and that works too. So now you can see all of your scenes all at once while you're playing the video and click through to see which ones you want to cut to. So you can play the video, pause, and be like, oh yeah, this scene right here looks fun to cut to that. You can make a cut in your video, click on it, boom, you cut to it, and then keep playing it. And the really cool part is that if you're really feeling yourself, you can actually play the video in your timeline and click on the sides here. And while you click here, it actually will make the cut so you pause the video again. Another fun tip is I like to expand the monitor out as much as I can and make uh, save this as a se separate preset just for, you know, multicam editing, just so I can see the clips better so I can, you know, actually see them. Also, if you ever need to adjust any of the clips like settings, like once you've nested it, you can just hop into that nested sequence, change it in there, and boom, you're good to go. And once you feel like you got to the point where you don't need to, you don't need no multicam any mode anymore, you can just select it all, click where it says flatten. And that will take whatever clip you currently have on top in that multicam nested sequence and make it the new clip basically and boom bada bing bada pow doing this will save you so much more time versus just having the okay you know i want to make one of those videos i'm gonna make one of those videos where it's like pro like the guys are going like like hitting his keyboard really hard and then me just chilling here like Yeah, I might, I might do that. I might do that. I might do that. Um, yeah, that's all I got for y'all. Peace.